All right, y'all, I'm back. Uh, it's been a while. Um, I figured I'd give you guys some content. Uh, I finally stopped playing Fortnite for a few days. Um, shout out to Gomer Kyle, Super Saiyan Joku, and DJ New Kid. We've been squatting up on Mondays and Tuesdays. Uh, Gomer and DJ New Kid, you fuckers, you didn't show up this Tuesday. We were waiting on you, you guys, me and Joku. Uh, but anyways... Um, yeah, my computer's still broken. I'm using this old one to do this. And, uh, you know, it'll be a while, a long while before we're back up doing the broadcast. But in the meantime, you know, I'll, I'll do this every once in a while and I'll make short videos when I can. Um, anyways, uh, before I start, again, if you run into this video accidentally, you're new to this channel because, I don't know, you're searching how to mix or things like that. Uh, uh, before you start writing in the comments, oh, this guy doesn't know what the fuck he's talking about. Yeah, you're right. I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about because I didn't go to school for none of this. Um, so this is not a fucking instructional video. This is just for motherfuckers from this channel who want to see my music process and how I make music. Plain and simple. I'm not musically trained. I don't know jack shit about music theory, chords, scales, or any of that crap. This is just stuff I've learned over the years by myself on my own. Um, and that's just, uh, what I do. But anyways, let's start, uh, making something, y'all. I'm gonna start by first, uh, starting with some keys. Uh, we got the keys there. Uh, Piano Roam. So one thing I've learned over the years is, um, how to use this program. Slowly. But there's this little thing right here. And if you click on this, it kind of lets you cheat. And, uh, we can choose any scale. So we have a minor scale. We'll just go with a regular minor scale. I don't know the difference between anything. So we'll go with that. See, like, because I have it selected, so it's already te doing it for you. You don't even need to uh, put it where you want. So I'm going to choose this chord. And if you notice, it skips two and then it skips three. And that's the basic thing about making chords that you need to know. Now, now that it just gave me the first one, I'm going to take take it off because I don't want it to um, fuck me up. Um, so that's just to help me get started. So this is what the scale or what this chord sounds like, which I don't even know the name of it, so don't ask. So that's what it basically sounds like. So from here, what I start doing is listen to it by ear because I don't know uh, what would come next, but... What I do is I try to listen to see what sounds better and what doesn't. And if you can see, because of the thing that I have highlighted, it's already showing me where not to click on. So the light spaces are the ones I should be using, and the dark ones are the ones I shouldn't be using. So that's the one I start off with, right? So what I'll do is... This will be the next one. And then I got to go. It's either two up. If you go two up and the next one's blank, then it's wrong. So you go three up. And then you go, since you went three, you're going to go two here. And it should be opened here to put it. So, And we can continue this. So now I, I want to finish it going. All right, 
Uh, now let me finish building the quartz for this. So here. Here. It sounds good, but I still feel like it's really fast. So I'm going to slow it down. So then I kind of want to add flair to it. Now, one thing that I you can do is kind of place these differently. I can move it to like from six to seven. And let's see how that sounds. And I can do that the same to this middle one. To seven. And maybe this middle one. From five to six. Watch. So I'll move this middle one too, from G5 to G6. Now this needs to be higher. That one. I like how that sounds already. Let's uh, mess around with the actual sound of it. Take that off. This is one that I like to use. It's called vinyl. And it's going to give it that vintage sound. So we can mess around with this. Let's try 1960s. We add some rev reverb to it.
Now, I, I feel like it's too in the front, so I'm gonna try to move it back with the pan. Or actually, I could just use a stereo enhancer. I like it like that. Oh no, we'll keep it on the grand piano. Alright, now that I got something going there, uh, let's start working on the drum beat so it could start sounding somewhat like a, like a beat, I guess. Okay, I'm gonna need some hi-hats in this. All right, cool. Uh, let's add some some atmosphere to this shit. I haven't used an old gun in a while. Um, let me see if I can. Oh my god! No, no, no. All right, let me look for the synths. This one sounds crazy. So, since I'm going to do this as bass, I'm basically going to use the bottom notes for this. A, C, F, and E. What I could do is just select them and copy them. 
copy them, and I can just come back and paste them on this motherfucker here. Deep air. So it should sound good because it's the same notes, right? Here's how the pattern sounds. All right, let's see how it sounds with the song. Now, I can even go and add an actual bass to it. Insert uh, boo bass here. Now, for this one, I am going to add that extra little... That's a pretty good one. Kind of depressing. <laughs> I don't know, I make depressing sounds. That's uh, just a little something. Uh, getting the itch out. I gotta do something creative since I'm not really doing the broadcast at the moment. I uh, hope you all enjoyed this. Um, like I said, it's just to show you my process in making music. This is not an instructional video at all. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. Uh, but somehow I managed to create stuff. So just to show you that anybody can do it, just, uh, just get on there and try, man. Get in there and do it. Anyways, y'all stay safe. Uh, I'll probably be doing reviews for new movies when they come out. Uh, probably on my phone while I'm walking my dog. So that should be fun. Um, either way, uh, thanks to you guys who are still subscribed. I don't know why or how we got two new subscribers. Uh, shout out to those two new people. I'll try to make content when I can. Uh, like I said, I'm working with what I have. A very, 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 very old computer because my newest one broke. Uh, so it'll be months, months, months from now uh, when we finally, hopefully, get back up and get this channel back and rolling. Until then, you all stay safe. Uh, and uh, I'll catch you guys next time. Peace. Oh, and cheers.